Welcome to the Terrible Take, a mini podcast telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Joe Clark. There's one matchup I'm pretty excited to see for the Pittsburgh Steelers in their Sunday night football game against the Dallas Cowboys, and it's quarterback Joey Porter Jr. covering Cowboys receiver CeeDee Lamb. Porter Jr. has had a penchant for taking away top receivers in coverage, but Lamb is up there with the best receiver he's faced. Up to this point, it's probably been Jamar Chase as the best receiver that Porter has covered. When he played against Chase in the Bengals, it was Jake Browning at quarterback. Browning did a solid job filling in for Joe Burrow last season, but he didn't have the same chemistry with Chase as Burrow did. Dak Prescott and Lamb have plenty of chemistry, and Lamb has been one of the best players in football over the last two seasons, and certainly one of the better receivers. It's going to be one of the biggest matchups of the game, and even with the Cowboys shorthanded on defense. If Porter can't limit Lamb, and he and Prescott get going early, it could wind up being a long night for Pittsburgh secondary. They have to limit what Lamb can do in the passing game. For Porter, it's going to need to be one of the better games and performances of his career, and it really could be a true breakout game for him if he is able to limit what Lamb can do. It's especially important given that Dallas is going to be down wide receiver Brandon Cooks, who has an infection after receiving an injection in his knee, and their number two option it's probably going to be tight end Jake Ferguson, but their number two receiver will be Jalen Tolbert. Taking away Lamb will limit the entire Cowboys passing game, and that's going to be important for Pittsburgh to do so, especially given that the Cowboys just haven't had much success on the ground. If they move the ball, they're moving the ball through the air. Ezekiel Elliott, Rico Dowdle, and Deuce Vaughn haven't really been able to get going on the ground, and the Steelers should be able to you know, stop that trio on the ground. So if the Cowboys do win, it's going to be because Dak Prescott and C.D. Lamb are able to get going and move the ball downfield. So for Porter, taking away Lamb and making sure that he doesn't really put a stamp on this game is going to be essential for the Steelers to come out on top and their defense to rebound after a rough performance in Week 4. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDebo.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with Alex Kazor and Dave Bryan every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.